Hi everyone, this is Suresh Jone from SNA Technologies. Welcome back to my video series on business transformations. Uh, in my last video, I had explained what are the types of business transformations that any organization can take. So let me just recap what I just explained about uh, these business transformations. So I mentioned that there could be two types of transformations. One is an incremental transformation and the other one is a radical transformation. Now incremental transformations are for those organizations who are not trying to be the market leaders, who don't want any radical changes, who are in a sustainable mode because of various reasons. One, you know, they, they might have some legacy and they may not have resources and uh, so for several reasons they may take that incremental innovation approach. So in that incremental innovation approach they are looking for incremental imp improvements rather than radical changes. Whereas on the other hand we have radical transformations wherein the organizations are trying to uh, uh, do, make some radical changes are those organizations like startups who are trying to make their presence in the industry. So they are looking for uh, radical innovations, so which could be from a business perspective or from a technology perspective. So those are the two types of transformations that we had discussed uh, in, the, in my last video. Now, in this video, I would like to give some approach uh, that you can take to bring the incremental innovation uh, transformation now if you want to bring some incremental improvements within the organization what is the approach that that you can take so one approach so the approach could be like so first you collect your current state right so collect your as is like so uh, be it like you know what processes you have what systems you have what assets you have right so that you can analyze that information and then come up with some uh, detailed target architecture like you know this is where we want to be right uh, and these are the improvements that we want to make and then once you identify your uh, uh, target architecture now come up with the uh, uh, implement solutions that could bring some those uh, incremental improvements now it, it sounds so simple but uh, you know I had seen many organizations who took this approach and uh, they didn't do well uh, in their organizations. There could be many reasons. So one reason is, you know, uh, they don't know what information they have to collect. Uh, first of all, they don't know what, what are the improvement areas or, uh, you know, what are their pain points and they didn't want that information uh, around those areas. So um, they, uh, they were not able to do well uh, to uh, bring those incremental uh, imp improvements right uh, and they bogged down in just collecting the current state right so there was no target state in those organizations for those initiatives if you're such an organization who got stuck in in collecting the current state and who don't know what improve, incremental improvements you have to make uh, feel free to reach me uh, my contact info is at the bottom so my uh, email id is s10 at snatechnologies.com and my phone number is uh, 2487192613 um, thanks for watching my video um, i would like to uh, uh, see you in the next video wherein i will explain uh, what's the approach for radical transformations so stay tuned for my next video thanks for watching this video